everybody welcome to my channel thank you again for joining me i hope you had a fabulous mother's day i know i did my husband made me breakfast and we went to lowe's and he bought me a bunch of plants i love plants i'm like a crazy plant lady he got a grill and some grilling canopy whatever i don't know anyway it was wonderful and this video is late because of him he forgot a t-shirt and i had to take it to his work <laughs> Anyway, today we have a bunch of fun stuff that I've been using for the month of April. Some of it, I haven't used it for the entire month, but I've been really, really loving it lately. So I wanted to go ahead and share it with you. So let me stop rambling and get into the video. Okay, so the first thing I have here is by Willida Skin Food. I picked this up on Amazon. Now this is a heavier cream. They do have a lighter version of this. I like the heavier cream because at night, even though I have oily skin, my, my face starts feeling a little tight. I'm really dry and patchy underneath my eyes so I've been using this lately and it's been making a huge difference in my skin I don't know if you could see how like nice and dewy my skin is and it's because I went to bed with this stuff on now this is great for your hands for your feet for your elbows there's it's a multi-use cream which is something that I really like I bought it for my girlfriend because she has super super dry skin where she says it feels like it's gonna flake off so she's been using it underneath her makeup and she says it's been helping and soothing her skin so this is like a really nice little find again i'll put this down below and this is well and i picked it up on amazon for about eleven dollars okay the next thing i have here i always think of kathleen lights i did buy this when it first came out and then i saw her review on it and she's so adorable and so funny and if you don't follow her you must follow her she's one of the biggest YouTube um, YouTubers that I trust along with Tati Westbrook, I always trust her opinion because every time I buy something that she recommends, I always feel the same way about it. So I really like the way she explained things and I just think she's a great, honest YouTuber. Okay, so I picked up the Pineapple Bright Serum. Okay, and I've been using it. I know I mentioned it a few times in some of my little vlogs, but if you want to see an instant difference within like a week, I saw a huge difference in my skin. Now, this is great for brightening, for texture, and I'm going to go ahead and read a little bit about it. So it says, reveal poreless, translucent, illuminated glass skin with brightening pineapple. This lightweight liquid is formulated with three types of vitamin C, including 22% pineapple juice. A potent source of natural vitamin C with natural AHA and brolian, I think I said that correctly, enzymes blended with calming chamomile. The formula retexturizes, hydrates, soothes the skin for a luminous glowing complexion. So it has pineapple juice, vitamin C, chamomile, and hyaluronic acid, and vitamin E, which is like all really good for your skin. And I'm telling you, I have seen a huge difference. My skin is just really nice and glowy. The texture is just a little different, and this is just a really good little gem here okay the next thing that i really have been enjoying is the kat von d locket foundation now this is the new one they do have another one and this is a like a little revamped version of the other one it's very very creamy I'm going to go ahead and show you like a little swatch. It's super creamy. So if you have a dry skin, you could put this powder foundation on. It's not going to make you feel tight or, or powdery or anything like that. It just kind of melts into your skin. If you have oily skin like myself, it's not going to get like patchy or or streaky because sometimes when I use certain powder foundations, it starts fading away and I start getting little patches and you know, it just doesn't look even. So this is great, especially if you wear it over a foundation, it's just going to give you a little bit of a more of a coverage, but it's going to kind of blur everything out. So this is a really good one. Okay, the other thing that I have here that I've been loving is the Natasha Denona Bronze and Glow. My am i holding this correctly anyway it's really really tiny so it is you know travel friendly it does have like a cute little mirror and then these are the colors right here i love these bronzer colors because they're just nice and warm it doesn't make your face look dirty or anything like that the texture is like ridiculously soft this is the color 
And then the highlighter is like a really nice champagne color. I love to also use this on my eyelids. So this is really pretty. And another thing, because I'm really light-handed when I apply bronzers, so I like that I could get, you know, a little fluffy brush and immediately I see a color and it's just, it blends up beautifully. You don't have to sit there and try to work it or anything like that. It's just really creamy. So this is also a great little find. And I also like the fact that it is, $19 because let's face it, Natasha Denona, as much as I love her, her prices are kind of like the devil. All right, the next thing I have here, and some of you have been asking me about this, is the Summer Fridays, and this is the Jet Lag Mask. Okay, this is amazing. Now, this is the little mini size, it's $25. They do have a bigger size that's about 50 something dollars. This is absolutely amazing. I've seen so many YouTubers talk about it. Another YouTuber that I love is Nicole Guerrero. So Nicole Guerrero, Tati Westbrook, and Kathleen Lice are like my go-to people that I look for all the time so she loves this stuff so i had to go out and get it and i love it i think it's great i love products that i could use in multiple different ways this is great as a makeup primer this is great you can put it on your eyelids underneath your eyes you could also use it as an overnight mask and this leaves your skin really nice and plumpy sometimes when i'm using all my other stuff i just put it underneath my eyes just to give me a little plump but in the morning when you use it as an overnight mask your face is literally plumpy so this stuff is great so if you're wondering about it go try it out try the mini first whatever but it is amazing i love it okay the other thing that i've really been liking here is my ole Hendrickson. this is the banana bright face primer okay so this keeps on your makeup all day long it has good stuff for your skin also because ole Hendrickson has really good products it has vitamin c now it does have a little bit of a golden shift to it I always have issues with the with the little guy here. Oh my God, I'm getting old waiting for it. But I've talked about this before. So it has a little bit of a golden shift. You could use this under your, underneath your makeup. You can mix your foundation with it. Sometimes I, after I put my foundation, I want a little bit of an extra glow. So I put it you know, on top of it. It doesn't just rub the foundation or anything like that. So this is really nice and it smells kind of citrusy. It smells delicious. Okay, so I have products here from ColourPop that I kind of complained about, about, uh, about, about, I've complained about them before, good grief. Okay, so this is the ColourPop No Filter Concealer. As you can see, I've been using the heck out of it. So my problem was that every time I went to look at it, it always, and I always put foundation and concealer in the back of my hand, and then I kind of walk around with it to see how what it does, because let's face some of these things oxidize, and I don't want to go through the trouble of returning it or whatever. So every time I apply this in the back of my hand, there's like a ton of colors. It oxidized. So finally, I found the correct color, which is medium 22, and it stays on beautifully. I don't have to sit there and touch it up throughout the day or anything like that. It doesn't get cakey or creasy or anything like that. So I've really been enjoying this. It just brightens up underneath. So now I see why everybody loves it. And this is just great. And the thing is, it's like really inexpensive. And you can find it at most Ulta's now. Okay, so I also complained about the So Juicy lip glosses because they're, you know, I was a ding dong and didn't read that they were like plumping, but I'm so loving the colors and that they're sheer because I love lip glosses. These are so pretty. So I picked up two other two, two more. God, and I look like a bottle cap on my eyes, but anyway, so this is a type of type of way this is a really pretty color you could also find these at most ulta's but look how pretty that is it's just a really nice sheer of pink and then the other one i picked up was make it savvy usually i don't like to wear these kind of colors but these are gorgeous and again they're inexpensive so these are really nice okay the other thing i have here is my Chic Leaders Bronze Squat. This is the second one. So I bought one for myself. I bought one for my makeup kit. 
if I really love something, I have to buy two of them because I'll forget to put it in my kit later. And then I go to work and I get upset because I don't have it. Now they do have it in a mini, but the mini is out of stock. I actually went and checked before I started filming and I was a ding dong, didn't buy it when it was all over the place. I cannot find it anywhere, but I love this. It is really big and bulky to carry, but can I tell you that this little cookie color right here is totally worth it. So I love the Hula Caramel also. It's a beautiful color. It's it's right up my alley because it's that color that gives you that nice sun kiss look. If it doesn't give you a sun kiss look, I'm not a fan of it because I just like everything to look really nice and natural and not crazy. So that cookie color right here. They don't sell this in a single, which I wish they would, but it is like the most magical highlighter ever. It is so incredibly beautiful. So it's totally worth it. So if you could find the little, you know, the little guy, it'll be better because this is bulky. I'm not a huge fan of these two colors. I mean, I really don't see the point in this one because I didn't. I apply it on some of my clients that are fair and I don't see a difference. Now this one right here is not so bad, but you know, I really don't see much of a difference again, unless you're fair. So it is, a, it is a good buy though. On the other hand, I'm like going back and forth because these two colors, eh, but these two are, you, you know, they're $30 a piece. So for $60, you get everything and this little brush that we never use. It does smell really good. Oh my God, it smells delicious. So I do love it just because of those two colors in here. Now the the caramel one, the Hula Caramel, you could actually buy it on its own and it's an amazing bronzer. So if you have not tried it, give it a whirl because it's beautiful. All right, what else? I think that is it. Nope, that's not it. Okay, so Burst Bees, this is the last product. Burst Bees Renewal Refining Cleanser. I love this. So now I'm so interested to see what other products Burst Bees have because this has been a great little cleanser. So this is a Renewal Refining Cleanser. So this says, helps restore smoother, young, younger looking skin with some of nature's most powerful anti-aging ingredients. This refining cleanser infused with our hibiscus and apple rejuvenating complex is shown in improved skin's texture and smooths. Our hydrating formula cleanses deeply without stripping moisture and exfoliates while re revealing newer skin. Okay, so this stuff is amazing. This is a great drugstore product. So this leaves your skin incredibly soft. It does have like these little beads. So it also um, kind of like exfoliates your face. It leaves your skin really nice and dewy and shiny. You don't feel like you have any, you know, dead skin cells on your face. So this is an actual like great little product. Okay, now I'm done. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Better yet, let me know what your favorite products are for the month because I would love to try them out. Anyway, I hope to see you soon and actually that would be tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.